time, guys. Yes. Thanks See for, you next time. Bye. Thanks for hanging out. Like that? No, not take that now. What? Why? <laughs> mm. <laughs> okay, welcome back, guys. Episode number two. And today, we have a special treat for you. Remember last video, we ate KFC, and I told you guys that this time we're gonna eat something a little more local, something a little more Thai, and that's exactly what we're going to do today. Today, we are going to review uh, a food called Khao Pad Gai. Khao meaning rice, Pad meaning stir fried, and Gai meaning chicken. Khao pad gai. Do Thais eat this a lot? Yeah. But not me. But I. <laughs> I don't really like khao pad. Yeah, she doesn't like khao pad. But if I buy it, I know I can eat the whole thing because she doesn't like it. So it works out perfectly. Anyways, basically it's fried rice. It's got chicken in it. And it's a nice little meal and I enjoy having it sometimes. Anyways, the place that I got it from, I think is pretty good. One of the best in the city that I've had. So I'm gonna review that for you today. And then also I have a special treat here under this so you can't see it, that I'm going to review after I review this. And they do give you they do give you this here, which is essentially fish sauce and chilies. I don't usually go for this, but eh, it's okay. You know what Thai name? Hmm? Do you know what name Thai? You want me to read it in yes. Thai? Yeah, you can show everyone how your Thai is good. Bla Sai Tan. Bla Bla Sai Tan means local. This is the local. Uh, local. Bla Sai Tan is Bla local. Bla Sai Tan. Yeah. Local. But the name is <coughs> Nam Bla Prik. Fish sauce with chilies. Okay, so let's go ahead and open it up. They do give you two utensils here. This, my friends, was just 40 baht. 40 baht converted is about a dollar 30 cents and let's go it's got some chicken you got your rice in here you got carrots uh, parsley uh, wait no parsley just a green vegetable no parsley some egg carrot mm. Good. A little bit of onion in there. This might be chives actually as well. Mmm. Right away you're hit with the rice. And then you get hit with the uh, the egg comes through, like the egg flavor, the fried egg flavor. And then you get hit with the subtleties of the fried rice with carrots and uh, the onions come through after that, which is very, and then at the very end you get a little chicken if you have chicken in your bite. And it just comes together very well. Let's take a couple extra bites here. Enjoy. Would you like to try? No, thank you. I think. Let's get Arista to try and see if she likes it. Okay, I will show you guys. I don't really like cow pad, but... She doesn't like it, but this is actually a good cow pad. So, if she likes it, it means it's good. If she doesn't like it, then... Not bad. 
กูเทสอร่อยอร่อยอร่อยค่ะ And then you also get cucumbers with this, which mm, I love is quite refreshing. After you eat the fried rice, you can go ahead and pop a cucumber in your mouth. You not use this one. Hmm. And it's quite refreshing. All right, just for you guys, I'm gonna go ahead and put the fish sauce in. Yeah, just a little bit, n h because this is. I'll just okay, put it in one area. That way, I can just taste it. Okay, stop, stop. Mm. Arissa put quite a bit in. Let's go ahead and taste and see, see if we can pick up on these flavors. It's quite strong. The flavor, anyways. Smell good for you. <laughs> Not a big fan, actually. I think if you like fish sauce, you would definitely like that. Like the fish sauce comes through, really, really strong. Yeah. Mm. Now her hand smells like fish. You want to try? Might not. <laughs> Still good. I'm gonna go ahead and pop another cucumber. Like so that's pretty much uh, cow p a t guy. So, like I said, guy is chicken. You can get this with other meats. You can get it with beef. You can get it with pork. Most Thais, I would say, get this either with pork or with shrimp. What do you think? And m o o That's oh, what yeah, I said. Pork. Pork, <laughs> <laughs> pork is m o o And Alina, what is called in English? Squid? Oh, squid. Squid. Yeah, you might get it with squid. You can get it with any meat of choice. I got it with chicken because I'm being a little more health conscious. Only egg, not put pork or chicken. Mm. Or just egg if yeah. you're. Uh, Vegetarian. Anyways, that's that. I'll eat the rest later. I want to go ahead and move over to the special treat, guys. Things you can find in the 7-Eleven in Thailand that you can't find in other places. And this here, I've bought a handful. This here, I've bought a handful of times, and I figured it'd be a good thing to kind of start off with. So let's get into it. And another thing that Arissa will not eat. Because <laughs> you will see, guy will eat that. And So basically, you have this package here, and you'll see the one, two, and three. And basically, you just go ahead and you start with number one, go around, and then you go for number two, and you pull number two away. And then finally, you're set for number three. Pull three away, and you are ready to go. Let in. <laughs> okay, so here we are, guys. We got it. It's ready to go. As you can see, this is seaweed, and the inside we have rice and salmon. And then, of course, we have the salmon inside. The salmon is just a. Uh, Grilled salt salmon. So let's go. You can show here. Mm. Mm. 
It's got a nice bite to it, the seaweed. Because of uh, how it's packaged, the seaweed stays uh, crisp and dry, uh, which is quite ingenious. That's why you have to open it in a certain way. Let's take another bite. Ah. Mmm. Whoops. Lost some of my salmon there. You went back? Let's go ahead and dive in a little deeper. This is cool or not? Mmm. The salmon is cooked. It's got a nice saltiness to it. Um, and then the rice is, is a great mixture with the seaweed on the outside. It really gives it, makes it easier to hold and uh, gives it a nice texture difference. I think this is pretty, pretty damn good. I, I do buy these sometimes as a nice little snack. Rissa, would you like to taste? No, thank you. Do you know? <laughs> I don't. I don't me. like uh, sushi, guy. More for me. Okay, yeah. here we go, guy. Oh. Mm. Mm. Uh, the saltiness with the salmon is quite good. This here was just 27 baht, so pretty decent price as far as sushi goes. And you can buy this at your local 7-Eleven here in Thailand. I've never seen sushi anywhere else. Is there sushi in your 7-Eleven back home? If there is, let, let us know in a comment. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching guys. I'm gonna get back to eating the rest of this. And then uh, I have some work to do. I have to take a shower too. Kind of stinky. Yeah, thank you so much guys. If you like this video, you can subscribe. Subscribe, yeah. like, smash that subscribe button and that like button. And we'll see you next time guys. Yeah, thanks see for- See you next time, bye. Thanks for hanging out. No, not take that now. What? Why? <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> Why not? Okay, do it again. Okay.